currently we are transplanting patients uh, in all type of uh, uh, settings, uh, kidney, liver, heart and eyelids using uh, systemic immunosuppression. Systemic immunosuppression is, uh, uh, consists in giving anti-rejection drugs that are very powerful in keeping the immune system at stake. On the other hand, they have a, a number of side effects that uh, we have to deal on a daily basis, which is uh, sometimes very challenging in uh, our clinical practice because uh, they, have a, uh, they affect uh, the quality of life uh, and the day-by-day -day, uh, uh, activity of our patients. Uh, if we could avoid the need for those very high doses of uh, non-specific non effects of uh, systemic immunosuppression for a lifetime, it would be very uh, advantageous for our patients because we could avoid those uh, side effects. So the concept of using uh, localized immunosuppression comes uh, uh, into the picture to really avoid the, those complications that are associated with uh, high levels of the drugs needed to keep the immune system down. We are exploring this approach by giving uh, doses that, that are uh, much lower there where are needed into the graft. And uh, we have uh, an advantage because we are uh, looking at uh, uh, engineering the implantation site for, uh, for islets and thereby we will be able to have a local uh, means to deliver drugs within the graft or where the islets will be implanted.